Welcome back everyone to more career mode gameplay of Tony Stewart Sprint Car Racing. And in today's video we'll be headed to Grant Park. Now Grant Park has very little if any banking uh, which is going to make it rougher on us with our low engine performance. But before we get there I'm really interested to see what our tires are going to cost us for upkeep week to week. And alright so $243. Alright so we need to go ahead and make some repairs. Uh, let's go ahead and spend some money on the engine and then of course we're going to want to spend some money on uh, the tires not terribly worried about these others but uh, there's not a whole lot going on here as far as money so let's just go ahead and repair to make sure everything is in excellent condition so we're back up to our 32 performance uh, and now is going to be our really our first opportunity to see how swapping out tire upgrades for upgrades in the chassis and suspension is really going to affect us because previously in the last race we had so much banking we could easily run wide open it's kind of hard to tell what role the grip plays in a place like that because it's all about engine power so here we're going to get our first opportunity to see what kind of grip we've got in the corners and maybe we can move up a few slots that's what we're hoping anyway so let's head to the track all right, so practice and qualifying out of the way. Our goal time of 14.22 in practice was no issue at all. I ran, I think, maybe two laps, maybe even a single lap. That was enough to tell me that the car was doing uh, what I needed to do uh, without spending a whole lot of time trying to dial it in to be uh, perfect. And then we moved on to qualifying. You can see the qualifying time of 13.18 was well quicker than the practice time. And there's more speed there. Uh, but again, it's just not worth it because the race is totally different from uh, hot lapping by yourself on the track. So I think we're in good shape. We qualified 20th. That's right. Our best qualifying by far in quite some time. So we're going to be starting in heat four. And as always, the goal is the A main. All right, top five, and you can see we're starting fifth right now, so we're where we need to be. We just got to stay inside this top five and see what we can do. All right, so as you can see, I'm trying to hug this bottom uh, pretty tight, give these guys the outside, and I'm going to try and hope that we can make the increase. Oh, hello. Or they could just throw us out of the way. Whichever one works. All right, guys, you got to give me something on the track. I mean, you can't just run me off the road. Or, I guess they can and did. So now we're back to sixth. We were doing good. All right, so now we're just going to get back on this bottom and uh, see what we can give them. All right, we're in fifth. All right, I'm liking our chances here. We come home actually quite easily in the top five. Sixth position was uh, nowhere to be found right there toward the end. So I'm liking that. So that now means that we're going to go to the A main and start not 25th, but 20th. All right, so could it be that uh, those tires are really helping us out that much? I think so, and of course along the same lines it means that the other upgrades that we took away and actually downgraded for the chassis and the suspension are not hurting us at all. So once again, I'm going to try to hug this bottom and just see what these guys will give me. No reason to lift here. We are easily wide open the entire way around. This is all about maintaining speed and not getting ran over like that. So at this point, oh, ouch. Guys, I'm trying to give you room if you'll just let me race here. <laughs> I promise I am not trying to block anyone. All right, so now I know the leaders are coming through, so I'm a little hesitant to get back down to the very bottom. I'm trying to give those guys some room. 
Because remember, more contact for us means more money than it cost us between races in upkeep. All right, nobody, ouch. Okay, we got tagged again. Yikes, and I was just about to say that there's nobody around us so we can run whatever group we want to run right now. Uh, yeah, so much for that. Still disappointed in the feel of the car. I mean, I'm having to rely entirely on visual. There's pretty much no feedback other than the random bumps that the game likes to throw in there. Uh, but there's pretty much no feel to this car. All right, again, all right, we got a little bit of a, an open area, at least for a lap. All right, I see guys coming to the inside. I'm going to give them room. Somehow we are sitting in 15th position, and I am absolutely, I, I really wish that you guys could see my face because I'm grinning from ear to ear right now. Because when you've been running 35th and 40th place, struggling even in the B main, to get an opportunity to run the A main is absolutely awesome, regardless of where you finish, honestly. And again, I'm, I know we're losing a few positions here, but these guys on the bottom are coming by us so fast. Uh, the leaders are so fast. In fact, you saw Clay coming through there, who is the leader. And he blew by us so quickly, I could barely catch a glimpse of his car. This also gets me really excited uh, to have the opportunity when we finally go to 100% races. All right, I think I heard one more time around. Or Nope, turns out we're on lap 13. Okay, so now I'm just hearing things. Yikes. Wow. Okay, so I did hear that. So we're just, that meant we were what? Two laps down, three laps down? Yeah, two laps down. Wow, so we'll come home 19th. I will take it, not quite the 15th that we were running at one point in time, but uh, yeah, you're gonna have a hard time getting me to complain about finishing 19th at this point in our career. We made it to the A main, folks. Let's move on and see what kind of results we get. All right, so 19th position, what kind of money does that get for us? All right, season standing, wow, we're back up to 25th, so we lost a spot last time. We picked that one back up. That gives us $1,200 in uh, race earnings and, of course, our sponsor payout and merch. We really got to get that merch up to at least $4, I think, before we can start making some progress. We got to get off that $3. Apparently, we are selling, like, one hat or maybe a mug or something to get us $3 in profit. Either way, we'll take it. That adds $2,100 to our bank account, and every bit of money gets us closer to another upgrade. So now let's finally move forward and see what type of uh, car condition we've got after a few bits of contact in that race. All right, I am happy to report that we got credit for smooth driving, which I certainly did not expect after the contact we had uh, at that particular race event. But I am perfectly happy to have no drop in performance after that race. That is awesome. So 19th place finish. Uh, you can see our sponsor goal of finishing top 35. We have definitely done that. Maybe if we can consistently make it to the A main, we can increase that goal up to um, getting top 25s. So after adding $2,100 to the bank account, that puts us at 7,700. We pick up 18 more fans for now a total of 79 fans. That is Awesome. But that'll do it for today. Thank you very much for joining me. And stay tuned for more career mode gameplay of Tony Stewart's Sprint Car Racing.